Jesus is about to walk through and keep going. And what do they say? What do they say, Donkey? They say, stop, you ain't going nowhere. Pretty much. You're good. Like, and what did the Lord say back to him? Yeah. Uh, no, he didn't. No, he didn't he say didn't. that. No, he didn't. What did he say? Uh, I really shouldn't be going. Mm -hmm. No, 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 we don't go, we don't go, thank you. That's All right. right. That's, what, that's basically it. From a donkey's perspective. Yeah. So, what he does is he, says, <laughs> he goes in the house and they break bread. And as soon as they break bread, and Jesus does that, yep, they're aware that it's Jesus. That's correct. And in that moment, he disappears. And then they said something really cool. They said, didn't it warm our hearts when he brought the word of God to us? So listen, and here's the thing. This is what all this whole story is about. Is Jesus any different today than he was back then? He's always the same. So as interested as he was in those two guys walking back to their town, isn't he just as interested in Jesse Joe and Andrew? He does. He does. He does love us more. And just like what those two guys did is they turned their hearts to the Lord. And he responded to them. He saw their need just like he sees your need. Now what listen, Jesse Joe, what we have to do is turn our hearts to the Lord. Exactly. And that's what we need to pray about. Ready? Dear Heavenly Father. We thank you for this wonderful story about how passionate you are for us, just like you were for those two guys walking back to their hometown. And Lord, we just pray that we would do like those two gentlemen did and turn our hearts toward you. Because when we do that, we really hear what you have to say. We don't just hear it, we apply it. See, that's what those guys did. But once they heard what you had to say, they went right back into town to tell everybody who they saw. Isn't that what we're supposed to do? In Jesus' name.